But what we really hope people take away from this experience is a sense of wonderment. It's absolutely magical. It's an amazing tool. Honestly, I think everyone should have one. It's cool. It's fun. It's really like tomorrow's brochure. When people are, you know, jump in the experience for the first time, I encourage them to look around, soak in the environment, because it's very much a Cadillac aesthetic. It's a view of New York City. So for folks looking at our VR in different parts of the country, different parts of the world, we may never get to our corporate headquarters or New York. It comes to you through this VR experience along with all the vehicles. Working with real photography captures detail that is hard to replicate when you're just working from scratch in 3D. Those are actual images of New York City that we took specifically for this project. We wanted to make sure that the 3D structure uh, felt just as believable. It's a building that only exists in VR. We worked with Gensler, you know, a brilliant architectural firm, design firm. They loved developing it. There were no restrictions. They could just express themselves. For the environment, we went through several design phases, went through a number of different concept images. Our whole programming team was involved on creating the architecture for this application, making sure every part of the vehicle looks just perfect. ATM's expertise in weaving it all together was really how it happened. The way the cars are lit and presented are perfect. The center console, the seats, the dashboard, everything looks so crisp. We've taken the whole product line and brought it into something that's consumable for a worldwide market. I think by putting the full vehicle lineup in there, they really, you know, put their stake in the ground. For us, it's really critical to be on, the, on that cutting edge. You know, we are a company we're, uh, founded on technological innovation. We had to be here. Most people now want something customizable. I can literally go inside, change the interior to exactly what I want, change the paint to exactly what I want, and have it look real. That's the beauty of what this is. I think the biggest challenge for us was creating a user interface in virtual reality. One thing that is unique about the Vive is it has a controller. We basically took the UI and put it on the controller and made sure the menu system was controlled by the user. If you're looking at a paint swatch and you wanted to see more information on it, all you have to do is turn the controller to its side and it reveals the information. To move through the space without walking, just being able to point a laser somewhere and appear there, it's a really powerful feeling. You've got literally thousands of components, each very precise, built from the actual CAD data that they use to manufacture everything, and that becomes the end result. You always get the right combination of parts with the right lighting and the right color combinations that the user chose. From the very beginning until the very end, they wanted this to be a tool to empower their dealers. And that's exactly what it is. We had a client that, um, like many clients, uh, was needing to think about it. And of course, when people go think about it, they don't always come back uh, in purchase. Rondell, our sales manager, was able to request that she uh, try it in virtual reality. A customer came in, wanted to see the dark Adriatic blue with the Kona brown interior. We did not have one available. She ended up taking a look on the VR, fell in love with it right on the spot, and placed an order for the car. It just goes to show you that this kind of experience certainly does move the needle. In the first week of having installed it in the first dealership in the world for us, it's all happening. Couldn't have been happier. To see what uh, we're able to show our prospects uh, and our guests uh, is pretty exciting. I think the VR is going to be a great tool to utilize going forward. I think it's a way that retail is changing. People that are completely new to VR are going to be able to grasp it, get a good handle on it. It wasn't a disappointing moment when you saw it all come together. It speaks to Cadillac in every way, and the vehicles are really beautifully presented. We're at the forefront of this technology, and it's only going to get better.